Yeah. Hi students, this is Dr. Badrinath. Okay, nano drug delivery system. Very, 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 very important nowadays. Nano, nano, everything, wherever you see, we are calling, discussing about nano, nano, nano. What is this nano? What is this nano drug delivery system? That one now we will see. See, first of all, the Lord Hanuman, he knows the importance of size. He has enough blessed with the God so that he, however he wants, he can grow. He will become a small size. He will become a nano size. You see here, he will become nano size. He will become a big size. However he wants, he can grow. That much of blessings he has. He has more. See, this nano Hanuman, the concept comes in the Ramayana. So during the episode of Lanka, Sri Lanka, whenever he wants to search the uh, Sita, he became nano. Sushmadu, Sushmaru Padari Sihasitikawa. That means he will become a very nano size, almost Sushma Rupa. That Sushma is nothing but nano here. So he will become a small size and he entered, he searched the Lanka for the Sita. Later, once he find the Sita, later he become a jumbo. He will become a big size and Bhima Rupa, there is Asura Samhare. He, he killed that, all the Asuras and all. See, like that. See, the importance of nano, he knows. Lord Hanuma. That's why. Sushma Rupa. Okay. Last nano is nothing but a Sushma. If you come to the science, nano is the breakthrough. Breakthrough. Science is divided into two types. One is the science before the nano, science after the nano. Just imagine what is the power of a nano. Previously, uh, sorry, previously one chapter. Now, previously nano drug delivery system is one chapter previously. Now it is one subject. Just imagine. It is one subject now. See, this is a textbook of nano drug delivery system, nanoparticle formulation and characterization is a special subject. Now it becomes one subject. Previously it was there in the modern pharmaceutics. It was one small subject. Nano, nano drug delivery system, it was one small chapter. Now it is not like that. See, so the science is divided into two, before nano, after nano, okay? Now, based on the major advances which is we have achieved in the world, advances in the nano scale, nano material scale, the National Institute of Health started the, in the year of 2000, National Nanotechnology Initiative, NNI, American government, American federal government, uh, he came to know, that came to know the importance of this nanotechnology and started special division. See, just imagine, previously it was the level of one chapter. Now, the chapter came into a subject that subject came into a department. Just imagine, I, you in the US, it is special department. It is having a special website, nano.gov. US, this is a US official website, nano.gov, National Nanotechnology Initiative. They have established a special department, okay, for program in order to promote the nano science uh, related research and development. For R&D in the nano, they started one special website, Okay, now drugs also now they are calling as a nano pharmaceuticals, not pharmaceuticals, nano pharmaceuticals. That means that all the pharmaceuticals which are prepared from the nano sized drug particle, then you can say it is a nano pharmaceuticals. So now we are calling the importance. See the importance. Pharmaceuticals is different, nano pharmaceuticals is different. Okay, right. So this is my mobile app. You can be download it from the Google Play Store. And after opening it, you go to the store option. In the store option, you can find all the courses like that. You can find all my presentations. My presentations are nothing but notes. My presentations, you can be find course-wise, MPharmC, BPharmC, PharmD, like that. You can be find it, okay? Now, in the future, see, now we are calling as a nano, 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 wherever you see nano, nano. In future, it may be Pico. Pico, P I C O, Pico technology. The future may be Peter, Pico technology. Why we are calling as a Pico? See here, nano comes here, nano. See the red mark here, nano. It is indicated by N. We know meter, we know kilometers. How many kilometers? 
meter kilometers per kilometer k 10 to the power of m that is 1000 meters is nothing but 1 kilometer decimeter centimeter also we know on the scale centimeter centimeter millimeters we know centimeter millimeter micrometer in previously we are calling as a micro particles microspheres now we are calling as a nanospheres nanoparticles in future in future we may call it as a picospheres Pico particles. Just imagine that is the power of uh, a nano. See, after after nano, next generation is pico. Next after that, pento, pento. Okay, right. See, now I have compared the pharmaceuticals versus nano pharmaceuticals. See, this is the transdermal patch. This is also transdermal patch. It is made up of transdermal patch having a medicine diclofenac sodium. This is also diclofenac sodium. But only the difference is this that in the drug reservoir, it consists of diclofenac sodium in the size of micro. But here it consists of in the size of nano. Remaining is everything same to same. Remaining is same everything, but due to the less in size, less in the nano small sizes, it is having a deeper penetration, not only deeper, deeper into the skin, not only deeper and also faster penetration, more performance, immediate effect, immediate effect. That is the power of the nano because of the small size. Yeah, human hair. A human hair is around a human hair is hair around 50,000 to 1 lakh, 1 lakh nanometers thickness. And your fingernail per second, per second, about it grows about 1 nanometer per second. 1 nanometer is nothing but a 1 tennis ball to the to the global earth to the entire globe earth to the entire globe tennis ball is becomes a nano just imagine and here you can find what is one meter 10 decimeter scales i have given here also you can go through what is a one nanometer you can be find here okay nanometers one meter how many nano one meter is equal to how many nanometer here also one nanometer is equal to one into 10 to the power of minus nine meter one into 10 to the power of minus three um, okay, and uh, inches, okay, like that I have given. Nanotechnology, now you can see the definition, very, very important. It is defined as the science, science that deals with the imagination, modeling, measuring. We are going to be measuring, we are going to be designed, we are going to be characterization, we are going to produce produce this is only important we are producing and we are analyzing the nano sized medicine that's why production and the application of medicines medicines structures devices and systems by the controlled manipulation of the size and the shape of the nano scale nanometer scale dimensions between the approximately 1 and 100 nanometers are known as a nano scale so diclofenac sodium transdermal patch you can use the small size particles each particle may have a size between 1 nanometer to 100 nanometer once it crosses the each particle, once it crosses the 100 nanometer, then you have to say it is micro particle. It is micro particle, very, very important. Nano diclofenac sodium means one to 100 nanometer. Once it crosses 100 nanometer, then you can say it is a diclofenac sodium micro particle. Okay, mainly number of properties will vary. The same diclofenac sodium, but if you reduce the size, nano, pico level, properties will be changed. What are the properties? See here, mechanical properties, thermal properties, melting point, melting point varies. The same structure is same, same diclofenac sodium structure, but micro size particles, nano size particles, melting point varies. Mechanical properties varies. Thermal heat properties varies. Magnetic properties varies. Like that, so many properties will vary. Mainly two properties will vary. Surface area. See here, this is a particle, big size particle. Same particle, you make it breaks, cracks. So surface area increases. See here, additionally, you got this surface area. See here, all this is a surface area. So surface area is doubled. Here, six meters square. Here, 12 meters square. 6 meters square, 12 meters square. You make it into still small size. See, same cube only. Cube is overall, it is same size. 
but if you are making it small, 18 meters square, just imagine. So uh, larger surface area, it gives you a larger surface area will be increased. That point you have to give small size, larger the surface area. Quantum size effects also varies. What are the quantum size? Electrical properties, magnetic properties, mechanical properties, all these comes in the quantum size. Surface area, one part. Another part is quantum size effect. So this is the total overall thing. Okay. So here I, I will show you the difference between the bulk material that is micro and nano material. See, nano materials are chemical substances. These are chemical uh, materials. Okay. That are of a uh, size of at least one dimension. In any one dimension, three dimensions we know. Length, a bit, diagonal, everybody, three dimensions we know. But in the nano scale, in the nano scale, 1 to 100 in any dimension, either it may be a length or width, at least one dimension, it should be between the 1 to 100 nanometer. Then you can say it is nanomaterial. So here, above the 100 nanomaterial in all dimensions, see here, it is at least one dimension. This is in all dimensions, that is length, width, height, everything, it should be above the 100 nanometer. Then you can say it is a micro. It cannot be seen by the simple microscope. You can't see the simple, you need a special microscope. You cannot see the directly through the naked eye. Okay. Advanced microscope techniques, you need larger surface area to volume ratio leads to better performance, such as in a, a catalysis or various things, high performance. Uh, high percentage of atoms which are present on the surface nanoparticle big particle if you see the atoms which are on the present on the surface here in the nano size more number of surface more number of surface atoms are present okay surface forces are very important here and the metal nanoparticles having a unique property unique use scattering light scattering properties varies semiconductor nanoparticles may exhibit confidence energy Okay, nanotechnology not only there in the pharmacy, it is also there in the engineering, it is also there in various fields, even food technology or engineering, okay, na? or in the quantum, whatever it may be. So, their chemical and physical properties are unique, you, unique, you, unique, you, just like other fingerprints, okay, it having a special properties for that size only, for that small size. Okay, like that you can be find all these things you have to write in the examination compulsory note down or take a screenshot. Okay, I will end my session here. Okay, thank you.